Hi, this is just a short follow-up video on uh, my last uh, video here on the balanced modulator and I had uh, some questions on uh, how did I get this uh, little circles here uh, onto this uh, board and uh, well yeah just uh, to answer it and to uh, show uh, the process on I'm just doing this uh, follow-up well uh, as you might know um, this kind of uh, board is uh, really a good idea if you're working with HF uh, applications because for HF applications this is really idle so okay um, basically uh, that is uh, what you have it is uh, simply a board a circuit board and um, as you uh, know you can't do your um, wiring right here onto this board so you need a kind uh, of islands so uh, that is uh, what we have here so these are little islands and uh, with these uh, little islands you can do your connection which are needed and I just want to show you how I do these little circles how I do these little islands just to be able to do all the wiring we need. Well, the tools I'm using uh, coming from this company, from uh, Dremel, I don't know if it is uh, pronounced in the right way, but uh, that is uh, the, company's, the company because they really have a lot of different uh, tools and uh, there we have a cutter tool which is really nice uh, for uh, this work here. Um, so that is what I use and uh, basically uh, it is uh, this uh, cutter here and uh, this is yeah nearly perfect uh, for our purposes so you really just need this uh, tool and you need finally a drill and uh, then yeah you are able to produce this little uh, islands. Well, and this here is uh, the whole secret. So, uh, what you can see here, this is a little cutter. Here is our board, and uh, cutter is in this uh, stand uh, drill machine. And uh, well, it is uh, really easy, like this. I switch on the machine, and uh, now, yeah, let's do some of these little islands. Yeah, you see that is uh, all you need to do and uh, well the only thing is uh, you need to be uh, really careful because if you are you know too rough then you really can go through the board and you completely kill the copper uh, and what you need is of course a little island in the middle so therefore the only thing is you need to uh, to do it carefully and uh, then you will uh, be simply able to get uh, exactly uh, what you uh, are looking for. So <clears throat> depending on uh, how much uh, force uh, you put onto the tool, um, depending on that you get uh, your uh, island, but uh, as you can see it is really really simple like this. Yeah, as I said, I think it is really self-explaining so it is uh, really easy to produce and uh, of course you can do your little islands wherever you need it uh, on the board so you can do some uh, planning before but uh, then you do it uh, like uh, I have shown it um, uh, on the machine and that's it so easy as this so the only thing is really 
that uh, you need the right tool. That is all you need to know. And uh, therefore maybe it is a good idea to have the order code and uh, this here uh, is the order core code and this down here is the EAN code. So this may be are the numbers uh, you need to uh, simply order this uh, tool and uh, then you can uh, write start off with uh, doing your own HF boards. Okay, so that's it and uh, it was just a little follow-up on my uh, last video so I hope uh, this uh, will answer all your questions and um, yeah, thank you very much for watching and uh, catch you next time. Bye!